because we're making history tonight, okay? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, a very, very warm welcome to the official launch and the big reveal of Rusty Lashes. <laughs> My name is TK, a dear friend of Shika, and um, yeah, to be part of this extremely special day is very important and very special for me, so thank you so much. Two besties come together, and through their love for beauty and fashion and women empowerment, they decide they want to create an amazing brand. So I think, okay, what angle does one take about lashes? Lashes. I mean, there's only so much you can do. But if you sit back and you think about this, this is not only lashes, okay? This is way bigger than lashes. You have two brown girls that decided they're going to get together and make their dream come true. Now these little brown girls have other brown girls looking at them. They talk like them, they have hair like them, they dress like them, they're successful, they're qualified. And the little brown girls go, I can also do that. I can also, like, look at Shika, look at Abigail, and I can also do that. So this is pretty big stuff. We are creating standards. We are, we are starting new trends. And that's why, again, this is not about lashes. This is something way, way bigger. The days of us fighting for seats at the table are over. We are creating multiple tables with multiple seats so that we can all thrive together. So congratulations, <laughs> And with that, let's quickly take a look and see exactly what the hell is Rosby Lashes. and get word out about this magnificent brand. This is only the start, guys. This is only the start. So, without further ado, help me quickly welcome the one half, the co-founder, the lovely Abigail. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I am Um, 
uh, like the timing and stuff, but we thought, uh, let's not wait, let's not delay, let's start now, even though lockdown is still, you know, going on. So everybody's asking, she goes, why? And I said, why does he lashes? So let me tell you the story behind does he lashes. So about a year ago, I lost my mom. Um, her name was, oh, I'm getting emotional already. Her name was Rosanna. So, can you give me a moment? Um, I really want you to see my heart. So her name was Rosanna. And, um, <laughs> and we decided that we're going to call it Rod's Knee Lashes because her first three letters start with R O Z. And the B is just basically my sister's name, Bernadine. And when I told Rashida that, she was all in, and I'm so grateful for that because she could understand why I wanted it. And, um, <laughs> um, so, and she was also very close with my mom, especially when she got sick. Um, she was diagnosed with cancer um, six months before, before she passed away. And I knew that Rashika understood that because there wasn't like, no, we can't, like, you know, our people all know we should use her name or her brand or our name. Or, she was like, she was all for it. So, that's what, that's what friends are for, they understand you, you don't have to say anything, they know. So today, I want to tell everybody that we are casting the net. So what I mean by casting the net is that the man that sits at home would not get the fishes in the sea. The man that actually goes out to the sea and casts his net, the probability of him getting a fish is greater than the one sitting at home. And that person that passes um, the net and catches the fish can actually share whatever that person got and share it at home. So don't be the person that sits at home. Cast the net, and that is my message to everybody um, today. Cast your net. Inspire, feel inspire, you know, inspire, you know. So that is what we stand for. And um, so I just want to tell you to walk out of costing the net. <laughs>
This is what um, not percent alcohol champagne does to a person. What do you mean? <laughs> it's alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> 